That is just delicious. Ooh, that's it. Wonder if that is. Uh, hmm. It's Thingy, the one that used to be with his Where friend. Are you hiding? It's it's he kind of looks like Sarge, but he isn't because he he, he he's not. Yes, that that's why he isn't. Let's see. I have ammo for this thing. This is a little dark thing. Who's screaming like that? Seriously, this is just uncalled for. What could go wrong? That could go wrong is what? And many other things, presumably. Nope, just two of them. That's what could go wrong. But at least I have a soul cube that's fully charged now, so I feel confident in my abilities to stay alive from soul cube activities. Heavy weapons! I wonder if I still, um... I picked up some PDAs earlier, so... Heading to blah blah blah... There are no numbers here. No numbers whatsoever, which is the only thing I'm looking for when reading... Martian buddy! Everything is Martian buddy. In the cabinet is 571. Lovely. And yes, rocket launcher, like it said in the message. Which you probably didn't read, but it certainly was set in the message indeed. Ooh. Hmm. What? Oh, it's one of you guys, little teleported bobbins. We haven't seen one of you in ages. I should not use that plasma gun when I have this little ammo. Meow. Who's meowing at me? Who dares meow in this location? Is it you? Oh god, it's you. Of course, it's the babies! It's always the bloody babies! I wonder if this means there's another mancubus anywhere nearby because they seem to be connected sometimes. I'd rather not. Though I do have a soul cube now and that seems to take care of just about everything. Which is lovely. What is this? I wonder if I can stand in this. But apparently I can. It's not very interesting, sadly. Is there? No, there's nothing in. Okay, weird. For some reason I couldn't get through it. But I don't really know why. But there is hell in here and I want. I want it so much. There's a red thing and a blue thing. So everything must be going according to plan. Yes. Because otherwise there wouldn't be a red and a blue thing. There would just be two red ones. I'll go there in a second. Is there anything else? Interest. Find a replacement door panel. What? Right, whatever. Let's find a replacement door panel. That is our objective. You were right behind the door. That was a little uncalled for. Good sir. But if you wish to be right behind the door, then I won't stop you. That's a phone. That's not an armor pickup. Ooh, I can move it. Yee. Die, phone. You are too big to work here. Ooh, is there something beyond that thing? It is a yellow thingy. Yes. I'm so glad I, I pushed that thing away because otherwise I would never have found the important yellow thingy. And that would have been so terrible. So terrible indeed. Also, I walked up to that in case I was randomly a door panel or something because, yeah, after that one incident where I ran around looking for the plasma thing, I don't really want to run around for ages again. Every time. But don't worry, there's probably going to be someone who can destroy it with their fists in a moment and then be unable to kill me because that's how this game works. Do Secret door? No, just ammo in this room. That's nice. I like that. I like that a lot. This is a... Uh... Hi, Archfile. I haven't seen you in a while. You tried to punch me, and now you're setting me on fire, and I did a lot of damage, and now I am sad. So sad. Enter Axis. Oh. Oh. Ah, why is everyone everywhere? Ow. And why do these things take so long to die? I kind of thought they were just little babies. Don't hurt that much. But no. There's always ten of them. What? Why must there always be more enemies? I don't know, but I'm picking up the health before I'm dead. And I'm also... I wonder if I can go back through this door. Of course I can't. Why would I? Because there was more health behind that door, and I would have liked that. But no. 
We can't help the health. No, we must die horribly. Oh, this looks bad. Yeah, this looks safe. What could go wrong? I mean, it's only hell things that are floating magically above a pool of lava. I don't even know what he was saying there. But, yeah, you would think that if Vitrugo is causing this to happen, then he could just make the things fall down while I'm walking up. Whatever, let's just ignore Vitrugo being an idiot and just find the access code and the door panel and why the light suddenly turned off and this little this little cone in here. Die, cone! You're no match for me. I can beat every cone by myself. Because I am very powerful and there's a pentagram in that monitor. That's a spider, spider, spider. Lots of spiders, so many spiders for me. So many chainsaws for you. That hit once, but it was totally worth it. Ow, that was not worth it. Mm, no, thanks. Oh, this is kind of bad, actually. No, no, that was... Uh, yeah, I could, probably could have told you that wouldn't really work, but oh well. There is so much stuff in here! Why is there already so many bloody things? And th more things, and um... It is kind of wasteful to use a soul cube right now, but I am tempted. I'll just do that for now, for that first little bobbin. You get... Oh, what? Did that door open? Okay, that was nothing. So many things to look for, and so many bastards to shoot in the bloody noggin. I don't know why I'm using all these weird words today, like noggin and bobbin. Jibbly wibbly. And why can spiders open doors? That seems rather counterproductive. You think you'd have a door to stop people from getting in every once in a while, but no. Ah, you can't even stop a bloody spider with these doors. Why are there even doors in this area? You won't want doors. Camera offline. That's useless. Oh my god! Oh, that is a bad, mean thing of mean. Oh man, that was the first good scare I've had in a while in this game. Thank you. Um, okay, yeah, I will give them that one. That that was a well done game. <laughs> I like. I kind of like that one actually. I have to say that that was a good job. I am impressed. And f screw you, I am done with you. I don't I don't care if this is a waste of a soul cube. It really was. Oh well. Uh, no thanks. Yeah, definitely a waste of a soul cube, but still you, you gotta use it every once in a while, really. Oh, I am still a bit shaky <laughs> from that uh, spider. Mm. Well done. And I know I'm just praising a little bit too much now, but I don't care. It did its job. Ooh, open maintenance storage hatch. Uh, okay, the storage hatch is apparently open. I don't even know where the storage hatch is, but it is definitely open. Is this is the storage hatch? No. Well, there has to be. Where is this the storage hatch? TD4, that looks. Where is that the storage hatch? There's a foot in it, and a PDA. I wonder if Tony Bates is the person with the access code to that door. <laughs> oh, that's just terrible. Uh, contract. Maybe he has a thingy. Secured. Ooh. This is the audio log for Tony Bates, Mars Security IT Division, September 25th, 2145. I spent the last four hours going through the code for the door systems here in Central Processing. Now, this is proving to be a real bitch of a glitch to work out. I've traced through every system I could think of, and access to Lab A continues to be problematic for the time being. All the regular access codes seem to be working fine, but the database will not allow access rights to be granted to new visitors. In the meantime, I'm adding a backdoor code into the systems for IT staff and the eggheads, so if they need access to Lab A while the systems are on the fritz, they can use the code 627 to bypass door security. End of log. 627, 627, 627 is the code I'm remembering. 627, 627. 
27 spiders on my floor. Why are there so many spiders? That's why there's so many spiders, because otherwise I would never get to use the soul cube all that often. It's kind of nice actually that there's so many spiders, because then I just keep the spam, get the spammer thing over and over. In case that happens! Baby! Baby! There's more of you! You're all unpleasant. But you do help me charge up my soul cube after using it on an arch vial. Which happens quite a lot. I have forgotten the door code. Wasn't it? 627? 627. Yay! Okay. I'm kind of surprised I remembered that, to be honest, because. Archfile. <laughs> because Archfile. That's. Hammer. I wonder if I can deactivate the camera and if it gets deactivated. Uh, okay, probably not. I guess only the monsters can do that. Do, 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 do. Do. That's probably a jump that I'm not gonna be able to do. But it's fun to try anyway, is it? Whee! No, no, that, there was actually even an invisible wall just in case. That, that's nice. That's, that's, that's just pleasant. Oh well, let's go on. Oh, that's not good. Well, at, at least they're trying, though they forgot a couple, which is a bit silly of them. Would have probably been better if they removed all of them, but they didn't. Seems like kind of an odd decision. Or just a poor job. Or maybe both. I heard a baby. I need my baby chainsaw! It helps me protect myself from babies. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Where are you, babies? I heard you. I heard you. There you are. Eat my baby chainsaw. It works so well. Baby chainsaw. Yeah. Yeah, that works pretty well against babies, as long as they don't, as long as they decide not to jump at me for some reason. Which they did. Which was nice. I, um, approve of the randomly not jumping at me. Definitely. There was a person behind the door. But he has some more armor shards in case I needed them, so that was kind of nice. Um. There's another person behind the door. There's quite a lot of people in here. What? And one of you. Oh, and I have to reload. That's uh, good timing. Good timing. I'm good at uh, timing my reloads, as you can see. You know? Oh, that door. That's not an exciting door. That's a boring door. I'm bored by your door. I do not want to see more doors like you that are boring. I want to see exciting doors that scare me when they open and reveal an enemy that will try to eat my face. Like the babies! And that thing! Totally tried to eat me. I mean, I can see the health thing over there, so I'm just gonna use the chainsaw for funsies. Even though I'm probably gonna have to go back here and that other thing only has 30 health. Hmm. That's a shame! But oh well, let's see what's in here. Ooh, it's that area which I couldn't reach, which probably has the, uh, door panel. Once again, no idea what he just tried to say. Whoa, I nearly fell off there. That's a bit silly. But yeah, not really sure what he tried to say. I think I just picked up a rocket launcher, which is not really what I'm looking for, and I already had one, so... I don't know where I have to go now, actually. Is there just something back from where I came? Am I missing something here? I don't think I'm missing anything here, but whatever. Let's try going back and see if there's new things randomly. It would appear so. Yay! Okay, that looks like a doorway. What is a uh, 627? That's the number I had to remember. I'm glad they put it in this monitor and not the any of the monitors before we actually get here. And picking up shells startled me. Yes, that makes sense. Um, 
Well, stuff spawned here, so guessing something opened somewhere, maybe. Ugh. That's getting a bit tedious, lad. Don't really like the babies. Who did that? I never noticed this door before. Did I just miss this door last time, or did they uh, reveal it? I probably have missed it actually. Hmm. Right, I will go there and see if level two has a door panel. Well, I have to say, not a good start to uh, sounds that you hear when entering a new room. Not a very good start. This reminds me of a level from the old original Doom, actually, for some reason. Maybe because of the very, very tight corridors. Probably. That would probably be the reason, wouldn't it? Yes. Da, da, da. Right. You're not the cube! I love that cube. At least it's going in the right direction every time so far. I wonder if it actually just homes towards the strongest thing. That would be kind of nice, actually. Hmm. Or maybe my aim was just impeccable. Maybe. I did generally aim it in the right direction, so maybe that's enough. I don't know. What's that sound? I don't know one of those, but I thought I heard something else. Probably not, then. Because it would appear that the things are dead, and I like that. Righto, I can go either. In oh dear, one of you, another one of you even. But you're not really that scary. So, I shall perch myself, looking at that thing. Um, well, standing on top of this. Can I stand on top of this? Mm, maybe, maybe not. I can't seem to be able to do it. But uh, yes, I'm going to take a small breaky break because I still need to make dinner. So, I hope you enjoyed it so far, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.